Um, anyway, uh, that was awesome. Up next, we have Misa Hampton, followed by Sarah Je Jekko. That's it. We just talked about this. Uh, and then Chris Lowe on deck, okay? On double deck, so. Thank you. I'm good. I'm good. Awesome. Just walk right up here. So let me relive, if you will, with me. I'm going to just do a few because they're short. And this is called The Land of the Beautiful. I'm in love with your illusion, the promises you make, and your righteous pursuit of compensation for irretrievable loss. I drool over your image of luscious reality. You show me who I'm supposed to be, and she doesn't look like me, but he looks so good in time. You embrace me. I'm so close and now so sure that hopeless is better than shattered. You breed your cattle to low and rented stables, march boldly to bloodletting. The best water is foreign dollar bottled at some running book in some Christine land. Tell me about peace and peacekeepers that seem to induce fear in me. At the sound of the gun, I sprint towards your excess with shiny red sneakers that blister my feet. With an angry pop, I puss and purge the gold-plated corn nugget I swallow. In the shine of the Chrysler, I wink at my golden halo. Wow. and dismembered regret our tainted memories paint the room with the results we've chosen to become. Like robed lions, we navigate our losses, smelling fear, craving flesh, and a monument in our names. We speak on lonely things with bitter sounds and preserve our hope with wasted words. We waste our truth on pretty things that tickle for a time, then fade to silence where we can rest for a while. Avoiding the sound of a smooth, round boulder on the bed that rallies our thoughts around the silly simplicity of a lilted tongue that speaks with eyes ablaze. We turn to ash, turn our words to dust, our lust to fear, and speak in prose like text, like toys, like trinkets, children's storybooks, like things we left behind in mountain piles of debris. I'll throw one more in because it's a request from over here from, from uh, Ghosts and Guitars. It's a little tongue in cheek, so it's a favorite. And then I'm going to read one more to close you out. This one's called A Dog's Life. Ah, uh, to have a dog's life. He rolls a tattoo poo and dons a pleasant grin, wears naught but dirt, a badge of white, and thinks not of his sin. The bitch, she sniffs and picks a mate, then tosses him away. A sense, a natural bitch of breed, shameless in her play. Light of foot, free of crime, from gut goes on to waste still time. Ah, to have a dog's life. <clears throat> With simple rules to buy. A simple game, no need to fake, to bargain, nor to buy. To have no need to twist, nor shake, nor ever have to lie. consumption. I don't need this. Mm -hmm. Here it comes. It, does, it feels like I'm looking back on myself when I think of this poem. All 19 and proud. Consumption. Consumption. The assumption is I need this. So I feed on this. And your bullshit tastes mm, 
so good. <laughs> what I should do, you say, is want this, flaunt this. I pay for excess, and this bitch, this bitch, is a customer. So this seat's for her. We'll lick it up, baby, and maybe you'll get that wet dream that haunts you. I know it don't you, don't it? The shit in your skin, this what you've done for them, having to find you. And I wake through my fishbowl, leaving my soul. The untold is flushed and rushed to the waist, and the taste of your sweets, tempting treats, lingers on my useless fingers. I got to eat. Got to eat. Tell me what you expect. Tell me that I'm next. I got to eat. Got to eat. I got to eat. You got the fuel. You make the rules. Bring my tools. Build my world while this little girl learns to redefine the sunshine. I got what I need. I see my affliction. My addiction. This glass junkie is an American flunky, and this is a hunger strike. Yeah. I always forget. This is the thing. This is the thing. I learned this in like sixth grade. I did. I remember it in English class. I think we were reading myths at the time. I don't know. Anyway, it took me back. So. We are going to go now to Sarah Jekko. Don't be misled by the C-H in her last name. It is pronounced as a K. Don't let it fool you. It fooled me. It is a K. It's a K? 